Hello everyone and welcome to today's video on layering auto flows. So you've probably seen already how useful the auto flow feature is in saving you time and how you can train big groups of clients all at once. Today I'll be showing you how you can add one client into more than one auto flow. The reason you would do this is if you had a client or group of clients who may need some different or extra training, tasks and messaging than they have in the original auto flow they have been added to. So now let me give you an example. So here I have a two week onboarding auto flow. This is really good if you have a new client join who may want some training, some tasks and messaging to go through. To add a client, you just go onto the client page. You can choose the client that you want and then add. You can then choose what day they start from and then confirm. The important thing when layering auto flows is the settings. So for one client, you can only have one set of auto flow settings turned on. I'm going to leave them on for this auto flow. And then on the other auto flow, I'll show you how they can still receive all their training tasks and messages, even with the settings turned off. So here is the second auto flow that I'm going to use. It's an eight week full body starter plan. It's got its training set up, its tasks and also messaging. So what I need to do first if I want to add the same client into this auto flow is turn off the settings. Then I'll go onto my client page and choose the same client to join the auto flow from day one again. And then I can go onto the individual client page on their overview. You'll be able to see that they are in two auto flows. You can go onto their training. You'll see all their training is set up from both the auto flows and the same with the tasks. They will also receive the messages on the days that they have been assigned. So an important thing to remember when layering auto flows is in the individual client settings too. For them to receive the training from the settings free auto flow, you need to make sure that their training, tasks and messaging is all turned on in their individual settings as well. This is a really good way of personalizing your auto flows more and making sure that your clients get the most out of their training. 